What's great about the Department of Orthopedics at Mass General is that we're able to combine these ideas that we have in the laboratory over time uh, with the expertise of our clinicians and bring some uh, really uh, advanced technologies to the patients. Orthopedics at Mass General is looking to break down the previous silos. The more we can hear from and understand different perspectives, the better we can address some of the complex and challenging problems we have with healthcare. We pursue research to, to improve uh, our ability to, to answer the questions posed uh, by patients. One of the most exciting new frontiers in orthopedic surgery, and in particular shoulder reconstruction and sports medicine, is the area that we call biologics. What we mean by biologics are living tissues that we can then implant into patients surgically that augment and harness the natural healing potential that the patient uh, has. We've been looking at how to reinvigorate the stem cells or the osteoblasts of the geriatric patient population in hopes that they will heal their bones fracture and potentially return to independence quicker. The field of uh, cancer immunology has really exploded and we're looking at things like HLA expression on the surface of cells and we're finding that many of our sarcomas and bone tumors lack HLA expression, particularly those tumors that are more aggressive and they seem to be circumventing the immune system. At the Harris Orthopedic Lab, we have a long history of developing ultra-high molecular weight polyethylene as a bearing surface for joint replacements. We have tried to solve many problems, including osteolysis, over the years. Um, and we are now focusing on infection because this is a very morbid condition. This new uh, polyethylene that is going to contain antibiotics hopefully is going to prevent early and late infection in patients. We're focusing on ligament injuries in the midfoot called a Liz Frank injury. We are focusing on better ways to take care of fifth metatarsal fractures, which are very common in high profile elite and or very uh, active athletes and other individuals. What we have actually learned, uh, for example, uh, in terms of total knee arthroplasty, is the importance of trying to mimic the uh, kinematics uh, of uh, native knee uh, falling total knee arthroplasty, which is a challenge. And we're also learning that there's a significant uh, variation from uh, patient to patient. Everyone is committed to a true excellence. Uh, people want to be impactful here. This place is known for delivering tomorrow's care today. That we are very much committed uh, to innovation of uh, our field uh, through uh, you know, translation research. Not only are we providing excellent clinical care, but we keep questioning whether we can do it better and how.